think the biggest takeaway that we've learned from, from the inquiry is that although the Africa Free Trade Initiative was a UK initiative, the perhaps surprising thing we've, we've found is that when the results were strongest and where the progress has been the best, actually that's been where the UK was acting in collaboration as a team with a number of other donors uh, and always with strong African leadership. So in fact the, the inquiry's uh, findings relate to uh, the development community, uh, trade and development community as a whole in Africa rather than just the UK. Also, other countries have similar initiatives. For example, the, the United States has the AGOA initiative. Um, and I think uh, certainly in the future, um, there's scope for you know, learning from taking the best from each of those different initiatives. But I think for all of the, the, the donors, whichever initiative that they're working on, um, they should all be looking to, the lesson from the AFTI inquiry is that if you really want to maximize the results and work at scale across the continent, then look to work uh, with partners uh, and uh, particularly where you have strong African leadership.